Chicago is a city of neighborhoods. That's how everyone thinks about Chicago, and we very often think about schools in terms of the neighborhoods that they're in. But when we look at data, we rarely um, are looking at data in a way that attends to the neighborhood. Um, when we do look at schools in a given neighborhood, we might notice particular neighborhoods that are underserved, neighborhoods where there are many failing schools and very few schools to which students could be transferred in a way that would meet their needs. And if we just look at the data aggregated by district, we don't see the neighborhoods. And when we looked at the neighborhoods, we very, very well might not see the CPS networks that the schools fall into, or the wards whose aldermen might have a big sway over the political processes. So what's important is tools like uh, uh, geographic information systems, mapping tools, interactive tools, where we can look at the different geographies that schools are part of, where we can look at things like mobility of teachers from school to school, mobility of children from neighborhood to neighborhood, and try to better understand how are we meeting kids' needs, how are we failing children, and how can we better serve the needs of those kids. And I think looking from a spatial perspective is particularly uh, helpful because most of the conversations around school, either for success or for failure, are anchored just on educational data. And most of these discussions tend to lack a larger discussion how this um, schools are really embedded in broader uh, ecological system or socio-ecological systems in where they are interconnected with issues of poverty, uh, disparities from uh, access to health care, to food resources, to mental health resources, and so forth. So I think the, the idea of mapping and have a broader understanding of educational process that goes beyond education will help us to better understand how these communities are served and how that impacts uh, the practices and outcomes that are emerging from the schools.